A Maui man is behind bars tonight charged with attempted murder. Sources say he's accused of shooting a pregnant woman in the stomach early Monday morning next to an elementary school. Chelsea Davis reports. The 19-year-old man is in custody, and meanwhile, his accomplice, a 20-year-old man arrested for terroristic threatening, has been released pending further investigation. Those who live near the park hope more can be done to keep that area safe. Home surveillance video captures the moments leading up to the shooting near Wailuku Elementary School early Monday morning. We blurred it to protect the homeowner's identity. You can hear commotion before a loud bang. Maui police arrested 19-year-old Nathaniel Cachola for attempted murder. His bail is half a million dollars. Police say he shot a 21-year-old female in the Wailuku Elementary School Park parking lot around 3 o'clock Monday morning. Investigators say she and her boyfriend were asleep in their van when they were approached by two suspects who asked them for drugs. Authorities say the couple said they didn't have any, so the suspects left, but later came back with a gun. They said the victim's 19-year-old boyfriend tried to rescue wrestled the firearm away from Cachola, but Cachola slipped away and fired a single shot. Sources say he struck the 21-year-old female who is pregnant in the stomach. Sources say she and her baby are expected to survive. Nobody likes to see that happen. I mean, nobody does. I mean, I mean, if you want to have your kids be safe here and not be traumatized, those type of things, you have to take care of where you live and you want your neighborhood to be safe. The Wailuku Elementary School Park is right across the street from Wailuku Elementary School on the corner of Koeli and Malako Streets. Smith says a lot of illegal activity takes place at this park, especially at night. With this park not having a gate, we get loud music, we get parties. We've also seen drug deals going down in this park. That is why he's starting a petition and asking the county to put up a gate and keep it locked at night. County officials say park staff is aware of the incident and will be reviewing costs and options for enhanced security measures. They said the safety of children and neighborhood residents is paramount. Reporting in Wailuku, Chelsea Davis, Hawaii News Now.